All right. Hello, friends, and welcome back to another exciting episode of Pokemon Reborn. There's one thing that I want to do before we start this episode. Oh my god, I just remembered. It's episode 60. Okay, anyway, there's one thing that I want to do before we start this episode and continue on with the main story, and that's get out of the library so that we can head over to Calcinon City just as soon as I get over there. Uh, let's see, Calcinon is here. Then we leave the city. It does have to be nighttime, so <laughs> I lost the door. Always good. Um, so we're gonna go into the Poke Gear, time and weather. For a while? Yes. Well, what is 17? Hold on. Five? It's almost six. Seven, eight. We might as well go until nine because I'm not gonna wait that extra minute. Fuck you. Um, in order to do this, but nighttime. We go through here. Out here. Yo, Hardy. Didn't know you were here. Um, and then I want to go... Here, I guess? How do... Hold on, the puzzle I didn't know I was here for. This way. Hi, Absol. Oh, woo, you're so right. Oh god, I have to fight you? <laughs> oh no, okay. I like that it says I already have Absol. I'm taking this one. Hold on, give me a second. Um... I mean, let's- let's try a Great Ball. That seems right. I do also have Ultras if you prefer it, Absol. Okay. Hold on. We're gonna do it. Come on, Absol. I can try an Ultra Ball. It's okay. I have a hundred and one of them. Okay. That specific Avasol. No. And yes, solely because I want to look at it, so bye Bisharp for a second. I don't know why Bisharp specifically, but then if we go... Summary. Original trainer, Ame. Interesting that um, it didn't tell me beforehand, like I didn't recognize that as Ame's Absol, but it's very important to me that I caught specifically that Absol. Um, and as, I also think it's really cute, so obviously I knew of that because of the walkthrough, which I don't actively have up for this episode. Because I think this episode is largely going to be story-based, and so we don't have to do anything side stories. Um, but I just really love the fact that uh, you can catch Ame's Pokemon. I don't know if it's all of them, or just specifically that Absol, but it was very important to me. Now I have to get Bisharp back. Because unfortunately, Absol, I just don't think you're really the best for this party. I do kind of want to look at you. Just to see. Maybe we'll look. Summary. Likes to relax. Alright. Mm-hmm. Alright. Interesting. Anyway, though, you're going in here. <laughs> I'm so sorry. At least you're safe now, in a box with everybody else. <sighs> Very important to me. Anyway, so then we are going to fly to Adrian's 
gym, I think, is where we go next. For story-related reasons. Adrian's gym is in Coral Ward. Alright, save before we do this, just in case. I'm worried. You know, I really wasn't expecting it to be fog inside. Also, who's gonna answer? Oh no, I'm so... I'm so... Victoria! Kit? Okay, how do I steer this thing? Can you hear me? Ame used to give advice to challengers using these things, right? But, well, you know. I'll try to see if I can help you, okay? Though admittedly, after what we've just been through, this is a little strange. I don't know too much about Adrian's team or fighting style, but I have heard that Z fights in doubles, so be ready for that. Great, I love doubles. And I heard a little bit of Zir Jim, a little bit about Zir Jim, when some of the students from Apothel were helping rebuild it. Apparently, Adrian designed it to switch tactics in the middle of a fight, okay? You can probably already see the mist in there, but the atmosphere Z constructed aside from that is enough to power up Zir Pokemon regardless. You might not want to count on just blowing it away, but then you might have to be ready for that happening anyway. Timing and adaptability should be key, so really think about when you'll use your strongest Pokemon. That's all I have for you. Good luck. Okay. That's... <laughs> First of all, I don't get Ame anymore. But interesting that it's Victoria. I'll accept it. Okay. I don't think I'm here, though, to fight. I just want to read that. Okay. Hi. Kit, you're here already. That's okay, I just wasn't quite prepared. To tell the truth about my request, I want to battle you. Fun. It would be an official gym battle, of course. Given recent circumstances, the actual status of the Reborn League might be unclear. However, Victoria and I will handle the administration, and as for the champion, that's my second request, okay? I want you to become the new champion. That might have been your goal in the first place, but now I think it's especially important. And I like it if it were you in particular, because from what I've heard, you've been the one who's done so much for Reborn's sake. Of course, that still entails collecting all the badges and defeating the Elite Four. Probably no one would accept your new role otherwise. And Lin... Uh, actually, let's not go there. Even if she defeated Ame, I personally will refuse to acknowledge her as the champion. I mean, so it wasn't like an official battle, though. And also, does she have all the gym badges? I don't think that would be official either. But we need someone who can stand up to her. You're our best hope for that. You'll do it, right? I mean, that's- I feel like that's kind of the point of Pokemon games. So, beyond catching all the Pokemon, to be champion. So, yes. Thank you. To start, I would like to have our battle now. However, I am a bit swamped, okay? I've got a handful of workstations that are short-handed, not to mention planning the recovery party for Devoncore and what I've begun referring to as the Dev Devonix? Devonix building? It's going to take me a small bit to get those sorted, but I could use your help, too. That said, I won't force it on you. Management is tedious work, and I would understand if you have better uses of your time. Are you willing to help me out with a small errand before we battle? I guess. You're a genuine treasure, Kit. Thank you. This will be somewhat... M m I don't actually know how to pronounce that word. I know what it means. But men menial? Menial? Probably menial. But I would like to ask for your help with recruitment. If you could explore the city and find anybody who might be willing to lend a hand to our work, I'd really appreciate it. If we can get at least five people, that should be enough for me to work with. Closer to ten would be ideal, and I'd make the difference worth your time, too. Please have them come here if they wish to volunteer. I'll handle the rest. After that settled, let's have our battle, okay? 
Yeah, sure. So I just want to, like... Okay. Interesting. Um... You got any ideas for where these volunteers are going to be, or...? Yo, you want to volunteer? Ma'am, say that again? Coral Ward is totally the place to be now that there's so many pretty things to look at. And I don't just mean the scenery. Girl. What the hell? Maybe I will use the walkthrough then, because otherwise I have to talk to, like, everybody, everybody? There's simply not enough time in the day for this to be included in this video if I talk to everybody. So we'll get um, the highlights, perhaps. All right, highlights ready. Let's go. In Coral Ward, a uh, brown-haired girl in the tunnel. Got it. Tunnel? You. I should be safe here, right? I was running from some strange guy, okay? I think I lost him, but I kind of don't want to go home right now in case I run into him again. I wonder if there's somewhere else near here that I could go. Oh, the Coral Gym is open for help? Okay. Volunteering will be a good way to keep myself busy while I lay low. I'll go help out. Okay. <laughs> Not uh, what I was really expecting, but cool. Anybody in South of Sidia? In the park? The blue-haired girl against the right wall. Uh, I'm just gonna... You! I think I really took this whole nature thing for granted before. Now that I've seen what it's like to have a peaceful area in the city, I want to protect it. But I don't think there's anything I can do. Huh? They need help at Coral Gym? Hmm, I'm not sure if I'm the kind of help they're looking for, but I'll go check it out anyway. Cool. In Onyx, so we might as well just keep going up, specifically in the arcade. Whoops, missed the door. Yellow-haired guy wandering around. Ugh, I've been playing for days straight and I'm tired of it. But what else is there even to do? Coral Jim is looking for help? Oh my gosh! <laughs> sure, I'll go help out. Maybe I'll remember what it's like to have a purpose in life or something. Damn, okay. Have fun with that. In South Obsidia. Yellow-haired guy in the bottom left corner. Okay. First we'll go to the bottom, then we'll go to the left. Oh, the guy who's like in front of... You? It's easy to just stare out at the sea here. I can forget that there's still so much work to do. Do I have to do it? Oh, Adrian is recruiting at the Coral Gym again. To tell you the truth, I was in the work crew before, but I've been slacking. I guess I'll report back in. Cool. Uh, in Obsidia Alleyway, which is not that way. Obsidia Alleyway, that's always the one that I forget, and I go over to the slums, but it is over here, and this way. Girl? Yellow-haired girl wandering around. You? Huh. I think I'm lost. Could you point me in the right direction? Didn't we talk about you? We talked to you before. Pretty sure. I don't remember where I was trying to go, either. Where should I go? Oh, I'm supposed to go to Coral Gym? I'm sure you weren't um, before, but you are now. I don't understand why, but okay. <laughs> girl, you're a mess. Hold on. Fight. Young youth. They always remind me of that one, um... Five Seconds of Summer song. Oh, okay. damn, I'm fast. Um, wasn't expecting it. You know, instead of Young Blood, but it's Young Goose. I'm lame. Anyway, um... North of City, a blue-haired glasses guy near the stairway. Alright. I don't particularly listen to Five Seconds of Summer. Um... But I do like that song. This way. Yo. Everyone is in a fuss about this city restoration business, but isn't it all there is to do? Labor work? If there was something equal to my intellectual abilities, I would surely pitch in. 
So the leader is asking for help at the Coral Gem. Very well, I'll see if they're on my level of brilliance. Yikes, dude. Um, Lapis Ward. Hopefully is this way. <laughs> I never remember. Yes. Silver-haired woman in the park, south of Pokemart. Oh, you. What's up? Well, this city's really come together. Not that I can claim any part in it. Perhaps it's too late, though. Huh? They're still looking for help at the Coral Gym? Huh. Alright. Looks like it's time for this old bird to fly into action after all. That's cute. Watch out, Reborn. I'm coming for you. Yikes. Then we go to Peridot. Which is halfway across the world. Whoops. Stairs are over here. E Down through Obsidia, past the Grand Hall. This way. Up here. Brown haired guy wandering around east of the train station. Well, hold on, because the train station's over here. Yo. My life's been much easier ever since my neighbors helped patch our house. I was going to repay the favor, but their other neighbors beat them to it. Uh, well, what's a guy to do? Oh, they need help in Coral? Huh. What comes around must go around. Seems like it's my turn after all. Alright, blue-hatted guy in the last building before the rail net. Okay. That's a little bit confusing, but... What? Blue had a guy in the last building before the rail net. But the only rail net entrance that I can remember is the one that's, um, in the other ward, so... Here? Yo, you're wearing a blue hat? <laughs> this sucks. All the old crew broke apart when our hideout was renovated. Now I got nowhere to do and nothing to go. Hey, if you think I'm gonna do community service just cause I'm bored... Well, why not? I go down to Coral and see what there is to do. Cool. Um, lower Peridot alleyway. The alleyway is not that way, it's over here. Black haired girl. Ah. Oh. The goth that's in here. Man, this spot used to be the place to be. But now look at it. This is just depressing. What, you want me to go help out with the city restoration instead? It's that whole project's fault that things are even this way in the first place. You know what? Yeah, I'll go down to the Coral Gym. I'm gonna give them a piece of my mind. Yeah, make more alleyways popular. Hello, Meowstick. Interesting. I don't like that version of Meowstick. It's okay, but not the prettiest. Black Steam Shelter. Which is down here, I think? No, it's not. It's up here. Don't ask me these questions. That's not it either. <laughs> Hold on. One more turn. <laughs> Over here. I'll get there eventually, don't worry. You. Guy... Black-haired guy on the couch. Down here. Yo. Main people here, they be- they real cool and all, saying they'll build homes for us and we can stay here for free in the meantime. But I don't get this pay- oh, this guy! Oh my god, yes! I don't get this pay it forward condition. Like if someone helps us, we gotta help someone else, and that's cool. And how am I supposed to know who needs help? I can't just go around asking every person I see, can I? Yes. Huh? They recruiting down at the local at the local gym. No. <laughs> the, the one that's halfway across the city. Well, I guess I'll mosey on over and see what I what I do them for. I cannot figure out what accent I'm supposed to use for you. Sometimes you sound southern, sometimes you don't. Um, Jasper. 
which is up here. Oh, over here. Light brown haired girl in the building to the left of the police station. This one. Oh! The one that I stole my face from! <laughs> Hi stranger who just walked into my apartment complex. <laughs> Why are you staring at me? <laughs> <laughs> Look, I already have such- oh my god, it's me! I already have social anxiety, just being down here is challenging for me. And it's not like I have anyone I could hang out with in this city. So, just let me be. What, you know a way to meet people? Huh? I can't volunteer? That's way too much interaction. But then again, I won't get used to it if I just shy away from it. And maybe I won't be so nervous if I have a project to collaborate with others on. Uh, okay. I'll try it. Um, goodbye. That was a little too real. Um, in barrel now. There's no more wild Pokemon in this area, right? I can walk wherever I want. Barrel bridge. Girl with blue ribbons. On the left side. So, you. Hi, don't mind me. I'm just people watching. They run around like everything they do is so important. Then again, it's not like I'm any better. Always watching, never doing. Huh? So they need my help at the Coral Gym? I guess it's my turn to do something after all. Cool. Um, to the left of the gym, there's a tan-hatted guy. Forgot that the gym was so high up. You! Tan, you could have said, like, maybe the bug catcher, and I would have understood a little bit better. You ever stop to look how, over how this city has changed? I've been catching stuff up here all day, but then this view caught my eye. It's grown into a fine city. Maybe I should help it grow a little more. So they're hurting for hands down at Coral. Alright, resting up here has got me invigorated. I'll go give it a try. And final one. In the library, which is... I only know one way to go, so if there's multiple... Listen. I don't know. Um, child. This child? I've been reading lots and lots about how to fix stuff. My Nana says it's important to learn how to do it. But just looking at books all day is so boring, can't relate. If I'm going to fix stuff, I want to actually do it. Hey, you mean people are trying to fix, fix lots of things at the Coral Gym? Okay, I've made up my mind. It's a long way from here, but I'm going to go help out. I'll check in with my Nana eventually. <laughs> Grandmother, I am so sorry. I stole your grandchild. Thanks, stranger. Damn. Why did it suddenly get darker? Damn, that child was really the light of this place. They leave and it's over. <laughs> okay, then we can... Let's fly back. Listen, all y'all can walk. I'm gonna fly over there, because that was everybody. I like that Adrian said to get, like, five. Five or ten. And <laughs> I got fifteen. Um... I'm worried about double double battles. I think I just can't use Bisharp. But the rest should probably be fine. So let's hope. Hold on, save one more time just in case. You're back. I just finished assigning the last of our volunteers. We've gotten so many and it's all thanks to you. I'm astounded. But then, exceeding expectations does seem to be your strong point. Thank you so, so much for your help. It must have been really challenging to go out and look for all those people. Here, please take these as a thank you from me. Wise glasses, thank you. Ability capsule, star piece. Well, then I guess it's time. I'll take my place in the arena. Take yours whenever you're ready to battle. I'll be waiting. Okay, um, I assume you're, like, back far. I'm nervous. 
Maybe we'll save one more time. Can you like catch things inside your gym? Hold on. It doesn't say anything in the walkthrough, so I assume not, but okay. Interesting. Whenever you're ready, you just take your place on the stand opposite to me. Oh, okay, Inkit. Even if you're the champion to be, don't think I'm gonna hold back. I really want to enjoy this. So I didn't have to walk all this way. You want me to stand over here? Okay. Well, in that case, then I'll save right here. I am ready. Okay, Kit, are you ready for our long-awaited match? <laughs> no. <laughs> yes, I've been looking forward to this ever since we met. Okay, champion, picture this. You're in your palace at the Hall of Champions, <laughs> okay? A new trainer, Adrian, has just blown through all of the elite, elite four. Z intends to challenge and claim your title. Now you have to fight to defend your honor. Although the rules are reversed right now, this is still a defining step on that adventure. So come at me with all of that same spirit. Show me what Reborn's future champion looks like. Scared. Okay. Um. <laughs> okay. Okay. Get myself in the mindset of Pokemon battles. Grand Bull. This charge is gonna hit me, so really I only have Wild Charge and Crunch. Um. So let's go Wild Charge and. Flamethrower. I guess, I guess I'll do both, just in case. Okay, just kidding, I forgot that Delph- Oh, okay, good. It was good that I went both for Granville. Okay. That's fine. Toga Kiss, I'll see you later. Right now I'm gonna focus on Gardevoir. Okay. Everybody here is going to need to get hit twice. Yikes, but okay. Another dazzling gleam. I should get a pair of sunglasses. <laughs> Honestly, just so I can- Ooh. <sighs> you know I have to go for it. Just so every single time that I get Dazzling Gleamed, I can just put on some sunglasses. <laughs> I don't have to look at it. Okay. You- what? The fuck is a Whimsicott? It's Grass Fairy! Why didn't it affect? What? I'm confused. Maybe I wasn't reading. Maybe there was something that would have told me something, but... I'm confusion. My wild's gonna be a little bit scary. Ooh, especially with... <sighs> okay, um... Why are my fire moves also shrimp flavored? <laughs> Weird, okay. Oh no. <laughs> okay. Okay, nice, nice. Um, not so great for a while, but maybe it will be fine. Okay. Fine. For justice? Wow. Shit, okay. I don't want to put Bisharp out there. Nice! Okay! 
I like it. I don't know what to do. I'm just flamethrower. Gorgeous. Don't. And that's why I was scared of Mawile. Secret sword for justice. Well, there goes that battle. It's over. <laughs> oh no. Okay. Um, actually, actually, Bisharp might be fine here. Valid, understandable. I mean, we're definitely not going to win, but actually, Bisharp's not as bad as I was expecting. I haven't had a battle this exhilarating in ages, even by my twisted timeline. We're not going to win this, but let's go. You're going to sword me again? That's not as bad. Okay, we can do this again. Well, Adrian, I'm not becoming champion. Okay, we're getting close to the end of the battle. It went a little bit differently than the first time that I did it, but um, that's fine. Instead of ending with Mawile, now we're ending with um, Florges. I have no idea what to do with you. Honestly, here. I'm hoping Gardevoir can finish you off. That looks like a no. Okay. Spion will live. Nice, nice. Okay. Then we go Primarina, because that's the only one we have left. Th this isn't great. I'm worried. Should be fine, though. We'll live. All right. I knew I was right to count on you. And there it is. Oh. There goes the mist, too. The champion keeps their throne another day. And of course, the challenger wins. There you'll be able to find two presents from me. The first is your well-earned Amaranth Badge. Cool. The Amaranth Badge promises that all Pokemon up to 85 will listen to you. Not bad for a champion to have, I think. The second present is the TM for Dazzling Gleam. Um, I still need my sunglasses, Adrian. After all, you've got the whole world to show off to. Why not be a bit flashy? Thanks. And now, I think it's come to- it's time to come back to reality. There's still a lot that both of us need to do. Victoria and I will take care of everything here in the city, but that means we're counting on you to take care of Team Meteor. Just a little bit ago, I was notified that Grandview Station has reopened, okay? Although the tickets out of the region will probably sell pretty quickly. <laughs> Everybody's leaving. I've put in a special order with them for you. If you go there, they can take you in- Oh! I didn't know the desert was outside of the city, though I guess. They can take you into the Tourmaline Desert. No charge to you, of course. If what I've heard is right, then not only is your next badge there, but one of the Crystal Keys as well. It's best if you can get all of those before Team Meteor does. As I'm sure you know, there's a lot that I have to do too, so I'll take my leave now. Please know that this challenge has been a pleasure, and I will always be cheering for you. Yippee! Okay. I've gotta go heal my Pokemon now. Okay, interesting. So we need to go to the station to go to the desert. Let me double check and make sure that there's not anything else that we need to do because it's usually like after 
a gym battle that new things open up, so... Oh, yep, yeah. before we leave the gym, head to the top of the room. Before we leave the gym, head to the top of the room. Why? You can find a hidden item there. But... Why? Like, up here? Yep, sure enough. Heal up if you need to. You can also talk to the left side of the flowery X. Here? Why are you here? Most impressive, my friend. So you were able to find my companion, solve the riddle, and trace me all the way here. Honestly, remember when I said that I was pretty sure he was in Coral... Coral Ward? I guess that does make sense, yeah. Because there was something about flowers, too. I don't remember what the other clue was. <laughs> okay, man. You are a worthy adversary, indeed. However, it is still not enough. And why? Well, that is because... I, too, am not the real Corin Rouge. Fuck you. But now I'll have to put an end to your plight. Man. Okay. Wheezing. Once upon a time. Mm-hmm. There's not really anything good here, so here's Wild Charge. Almost. Okay. Then I guess we'll go for a Discharge? Gengar. Sup? How do you feel about Discharge? Why are you so shiny, too? Oh, okay. Do it again. <laughs> I got my sunglasses again. This is maybe a bad idea, but I want to try it anyway. You have, like, one health. Let's go, Gardevoir. Goodbye, Gardevoir. Alright, um... In that case... Just set it all on fire again! Shrimp-flavored fire. You may have won the battle, but I'm afraid you've lost the war. So would you like to know where the real Corin Rouge is? No tricks this time. After all, his plan has already succeeded, okay? Corin just needed to buy some time until his getaway was ready. And now, it's nearly the time. The real Corin Rouge is one of the three fools you fought before you found me. Really? But which one? If you hurry, maybe you can still catch him. <laughs> just kidding, there's no hope for that. And now, I will take my leave. May we meet again? Never. What the hell is this quest in general? Just... Man, I just want my Pokemon that you stole from me that I'm pretty sure is Magikarp. So I had to pay so much money for it and I'm going through so much problems. Okay, um, next. Oh, interesting. Head to... Peridot. The north side of Peridot? Interesting. Hold on, that's halfway across the world. I could fly. However, I feel like it takes too long to fly. Peridot's not that far away. Alright, so into the north side of Peridot.
which I assume is up here. I assume it's the one that we already talked to? You. As promised, I'll give you a hint for where to find the true Corin Rouge. Find him in the place where Miss Settle. That's all you'll get from me. I thought you were the one that I needed to talk to. Return to the north side of Peridot and talk to this guy. <laughs> You're still staring at me. You know, don't you? You were the real one! <laughs> Okay. What a pity, though. You've worked so hard, and now it's all for nothing because you're too late. I've bought just enough time for my train to finally come in. Honestly, that felt a little bit too fast. <laughs> what the hell? Get back here! Okay. Head into Jasper now. And talk to the police chief. <laughs> like, we're finally telling on him. It's been so long. <laughs> Somebody stole from me. <laughs> um, where am I going? This way. <laughs> so discombobulated by that being the real Corin Rouge. Oh my goodness. Okay, man, get out of my way. You made me run into a stop sign. Okay. In here to talk to the chief. Any news on the Corin Rouge case? <laughs> yeah, man, he fucking got away. So he was able to flee the city. I see. Then it's out of our hands. Well, don't feel too bad about it, sport. You did well in finding him. In one way or another, he's gone, so while he won't be hurting... Sure. He won't be hurting anyone here for a while. Still, I suspect he won't stray too far. He's probably in the desert. He knows this area like the back of his hand, meaning he'll probably come back after laying low for a while. That's valid too, yeah. Considering the direction he took, there might still be a chance to find him. Of course, the one most suited to the job is you. Are you sure? I just let him get away. Just make sure to drag him back here so we can lock the loud up. Ah, I know. If you're going to chase him north into the Tourmaline Desert, maybe these can help protect you. Good luck out there. Okay. <laughs> now we want to go back to Lower Peridot. On a clear day. It's nighttime right now. Hold on, first of all, I guess I should just stay here. I don't know what I'm looking at. Um, for a while, it's currently 2021. 20, which means I have to do math. Because I don't know what time it is. It's currently 9 p.m. <laughs> so I need to do 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, just in case. Just in case. And oh, it uh, also... It needs to be clear. Sorry, excuse me. I don't know if that's still morning or if that's daytime, but... Hopefully that's good. Um, got the hiker moved into a new house. We'll find him southeast of the Pokemon Center. Which way do you think southeast is? This way. Southeast of the Pokemon Center? You? A hiker. Right? Friend! Do you remember me? It's been so long. You helped me find a home when I had none. It is true, I was planning to leave this place as soon as I could. And now, Grandview Station is finally open. But I have decided to stay, of course. Your kindness, and that of the city, have shown me this is a better place to be anyway. That old shack you found me was hardly a home until one day a fellow named Adrian knocked on it. That person laid out their plans, and you can see what has become of them. Not a bad investment, and I was all too happy to help them rebuild other parts of the city in return. So Reborn is my home now. 
and I will not forget you, friend. I want you to have this one last token of my thanks. Thank you. I hope you have been taking good care of my onyx as well. I definitely remember that, yes. Be strong. Reborn does not break, nor do its people. Okay. Um. There's a new move tutor. Not that it really matters to me. Okay. Head over to the Grand Hall. Sure. Just a bunch of little side quests to do, you know? We did a gym battle, and therefore I... It must be Friday. <laughs> Interesting. Unless, as I said... I'm in weather. It's Sunday in game. I thought it was only Fridays on clear days, but... I guess not. I don't know. In here, what am I doing? One of the guys behind the desk. One, just one of the guys behind the desk. You. Cool. Well then. <laughs> Not sure where to head? No. Reborn Pokemon Reintroduction Project. In an effort to revitalize wildlife and natural surroundings, a large number of Pokemon have recently been imported into the region. We hope that they will successfully repopulate the region, provided, of course, trainers do not capture them. <laughs> so you're not the person behind the desk either? Uh, Future of Reborn City Restoration Project. We've come a long way in a short period of time. For this, we are endlessly thankful for the help of all of our volunteers. Sure. Here's some of the things we'll be looking at doing in the near future. We have several potential short-term projects awaiting funding. This is what I want. I want to fund things. We'd like to focus on rebuilding the slums area from the ground up. Our plan is to convert this area into a low-income housing district and resource center with community gardening and job-finding resources. Second, we'll look at reinforcing underground structures and rebuilding an efficient inner-city subway system. Finally, we'll be restarting the Reborn Pokemon Reinstruction Project with a brand new fully furnished facility on Azarine Island, okay? If you wish to donate to the city restoration, please talk to the construction manager here. We are ecstatic to receive any amount of support. Who's the construction manager? Am I looking for a hard hat? Are you the construction manager? I don't care which one I do. It just tells me to do it. We can only choose to fund one right now, then each of the other two as soon as we get the 15th and 16th gym badges. I think I'm just going to go down the list, so we'll go affordable living first. Hold on, how many zeros is that? Three, 60,000. That's how I, that's how I read numbers by the way, I count how many zeros, so I can put a comma there in my mind, and then I figure out what the number is. 60,000. That covers the project. I know, I'm rich as fuck. I'll let everyone know that it's been fully funded and we'll set to work right away. Look forward to it. By the way, since you are the sole proprietary founder for at least one project, yes, we'd like to extend to you our warmest thanks. For policy, we invite you to meet the employees who work so hard with your money to keep this city thriving. Our employee area is in the basement below here, and as a premier modern founder, you will now be permitted access at will to it. All we ask is that you be courteous to the employees working there. Thank you again for always looking out for Reborn City. Thanks! So then we can go into the basement. Interesting. Uh, okay, police officers. Victoria! Oh, Kit, they let you in. Yeah, I paid... <laughs> I paid a lot of money for this. Now that that's a problem, frankly, I could use the company. This desk work is completely mind-numbing. I'm used to being out there and moving my body. All this computer stuff is such a drag. How can anyone just sit here all day? But ugh, the paperwork never ceases. Oh, was that it? I should call Julia and ask for some of her strongest. Oh, I thought... We were, like, gonna have a conversation. I thought 
you'd be like, hey, thanks for the money. That's a lot of coffee mugs, I just now noticed. I get the Julia comment now. <laughs> oh, also there's a room down here, I'm not reading the walkthrough. There's a room down here that has things. Somewhere? Corporate. I thought it was that one. The bottom room on the right. Was that not the bottom room on the right? Maybe it's this one. This one. We can find a mint. We can find XP candy. We can find... <gasps> a modest mint? I just remembered something that I didn't do. A record book lists names of reborn league leaders, past and present. Most of the names are familiar, but one is circled in red. Yuffie. Why? Okay. Next door. You can find two... EV boosters. Hold on, give me a second. Thanks. One more thing to do, and then we'll do that thing that I just remembered. Um, if you enter the room at the very top... This one? And talk to the computer. Hi computer, how are you? A secret switch! Press it? Yeah. Who wouldn't? <laughs> I love when it says that. Oh hi. That's a lot of beds. I take? You're so right. And you should say it? Oh, there's one... Interesting. Well, <laughs> have fun. Um, anyway, like I said, I think eventually all of those, like, just take over this area. I don't know, I've unleashed them into the unwilling public. I thought I had read somewhere that at one point you can just unleash Vulpix everywhere, but maybe not. Um... Anyway, the one thing that I wanted to do looking at that journal is that all the way back in, um, I can't remember what ward it is, this one over here, we, hold on, I was getting too excited, I can't walk over here and talk at the same time, um, in Corey's gym, we had gone in there for some reason, into like his house, and I had seen a book. I had seen it like wall editing in here, and I was like, oh, I want to read that, and I completely forgot. So now that I saw that other book that said like Yuffie in it, what does this say? For Heather, oh no. <laughs> I've made mistakes. By the time you read this, you will be strong. Oh no. <laughs> Oh no, I was not raised to be strong, okay? I was raised to be naive, and I have suffered for it. I shall not make the same mistake with you. Reality is cruel. This I learned the hard way. This you have grown to learn from the second you were born. I told you long ago how she passed. I did not mention who was responsible for it. Team Meteor sought to cleanse the city and restore it to its former heritage. A holy sight. To this end, they take no prisoners. I was forced to join their ranks, but I did so to sabotage them. Specifically, I sought the head of the man who killed your mother. He was after an artifact I foolishly bestowed upon her. He saw her life as a small price to pay for it. I will see to it that he pays what's due in his own blood. If you will join me, I will have you. It is your right as her daughter. The man ended her life in poison. When I discovered her IV was laced, I struck out. One of the few things I can still take pride in is that man's scream as he pulled the syringe from his bleeding eye. He lived, but his wound is a mark on his life. Since then, I coveted the venom that ended Elena's life. 
From it, I have made poisons to corrupt, poisons to control, and poisons to deliver retribution upon the guilty. My beautiful daughter, who is not me, <laughs> I could not be more proud of you for inheriting all of her friends, her strengths, and her passions. Someday, we will settle this together. <laughs> Maybe not together, but like... <sighs> okay. <laughs> Why did I want to read that? Oh no. Okay. What can we do for the next three minutes? What's next? Okay, if we actually go check out the slums that the, you know, we paid money to make look better. I did just like walk over this corner and see this area. So that's fun and interesting. We can get a lot of berries. Not that I'm, I thought this man was um, here and I was very surprised that he walked right on top of me. I can't say I ever imagined living in a place like this. Gotta say, it's almost too good to be true. Hi. Excuse me, do you have a moment to spare for the sake of this beautiful planet? I guess. Thank you for caring about the world we live in. The truth is, despite every single one of us being dependent on this planet, many people just don't give it the time of day. Reborn has definitely come a long way, but the thoughtlessness that led to its decline before is still alive and well. Every day, the environment is harmed further. Many innocent and sweet Pokemon are losing their homes. Did you know that every year, over 10,000 Wingle are caught in landfills that aren't properly contained? And every month, there are thousands of water Pokemon in seas all across the world dying because of underwater pollution. My goal is to change that. Your support can go a long way to making tomorrow a little brighter. Would you be willing to sign this petition to make the city board acknowledge the still lingering threat? of environmental detractors and reborn is what I'd like to say, but the truth is we already got plenty of signatures during the restoration, but the city still hasn't acted appropriately in response. And now everyone's so caught up in how great the city looks now that they're forgetting everything that's slipping through the cracks. To be honest, I'm getting kind of desperate here. Um, hey, I'm thinking about taking matters into my own hands. Would you be willing to back me up, I guess? Really? Okay, we can do this. Let's fight for the planet. By the way, my name's Sandy, and you are? Kit, it's a pleasure to meet you. So, let's talk about our first mission. This restoration has been a huge improvement for the region overall, but there's one part of Reborn that's suffering as a result. Malchus Forest! The deforestation of Malchus has been causing more and more Pokemon to lose their precious homes. I just can't stand by while that happens. Meet me at Malchus Forest Park, and let's put a stop to it. I guess. I mean, I wanted to explore a little bit, but... What the hell is this place? It's been years since I got any kind of real work, but this volunteer stuff is tiring. They keep working us with the city to fix up stuff for restoration, and that's cool and all, but brother, if I have to fetch one more load of bricks... Well, I don't know, but I ain't gonna be happy. Okay. This is- there's a lot going on here. There are things that I need to pick up. This is so strange to me. But, um, we are getting to around an hour, so I should probably end this episode here. Next episode, we'll try to find the things that I'm looking for, uh, because I don't know where they are right now. I guess maybe we'll try to find Sandy again and do stuff in Malchus Forest? But I will end this episode for now. So, thank you for watching. I hope that you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next episode for some more Pokemon Reborn.